Hi everyone and welcome to another Witcher 3 video. It has been a long time since I've done a video like this, but I'm glad to be back. So, do you remember this guy who sits on top of his lake and protects Arendite? Hey, happen to know how the hell I can walk on that water? Naturally, I know. Since time immemorial have I dwelt in solitude on this shore, and I can testify to the extraordinary nature of the lake. Well, he seems to be pretty proud about this magic lake and the fact that only he and this fish lady can get inside of the water. We've met before. Certainly. The hermit admitted he knew you, remember? But what if I tell you that with the use of a little glitch you can get inside of the lake and take a swim? And I'm gonna show you this funny and interesting thing about Tucson today. Feel free to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more, and it also supports me a lot. So thank you for everyone that decided to subscribe. We will begin at the prison of Toussaint, because there you can perform a glitch that allows you to get underground of the map. I actually showed this in one of my previous videos, but I never had the chance to properly explain it. So behind the prison in Toussaint, you can find a cave. And inside of this cave there is a little gap in the roof of it. So if you swim the same way like I show in the video, you should be underground in no time. Once you're underground it's actually pretty easy, because you only need to watch out for two things. First of all, don't get too close to the ground, because you might glitch back up. Oh no! And second, don't get too close to caves, because there the water stops and you will fall down. But if you watch out for those two things and swim a while towards the lake, you will reach a large water wall. Now this wall exists because the water level of the lake is different to the water level around the prison. All you have to do now is dive into that water wall and swim back up to the surface. It gets a bit close with the breath, so you might want to take a killer whale potion that allows you to breathe longer underwater, but it's also doable without the potion. So search a spot where you can get some air and take a deep breath because if you continue swimming towards the center of the lake you will get teleported really far underwater again. Now swim back up to the water surface one more time aiming towards those two rocks and you will find yourself inside of the lake Lac C'est la Vie. Wow, I'm glad I could say that with my French pronunciation. All of a sudden you are now worthy to get inside of the lake without even getting tested by Hermit. Now you can take a swim in this lake for as long as you want and take a close look at the fishes inside of it. By the way, I also tried to interact with the sword Arendite, but I wasn't able to. Which is good, I guess, because it would have been pretty stupid otherwise. If you want to get outside the lake again, just swim behind Hermit, where you stick out of the lake halfway and choose the dialogue option with him. Hey, maybe you should enchant your lake a bit better the next time. But thanks for watching and then I'll see you in the next one.